Check it out. Today we'll be reviewing the Sigma Paint A line. So this is the low pressure. I'm using the A092. This is a lime green color, real nice, and we'll be reviewing it on a wide variety of caps. I will uh, put timestamps at which I review each cap in the kind of description of the video, so you can go click to one if you're looking for one in particular. As well as at the end, I will have a um, kind of just a recap of which one works the best and why. So uh, without further ado, we'll start this off with the A low pressure. Right, to start, we have the German outline number four. I'm pretty sure this is the cap that will be standard on all the cans as it's which one came with mine. So this is the German outline number four again. And uh, so let's start it off. We'll do a spray, circle, and then a line for every one of these. So that's probably that's a bit of a medium line I'd say. Next up we have the fresh paint skinny. This uh, comes with all the fresh paint cans from Oink Art. That produces a lot more paint and as you can see the circles dripping from the start. Next up we've got the Iron Lack Vegan cap. Pink stock tip. A bit softer and a little bit smaller. Do uh, Sabotaz Fat, or now Sigma Fat. Got a beige dot. Nice skinny line on that. Pink dot fat cap. I'm not sure which uh, title this uh, vegan cap is, but it's uh, the stemmed iron lac stock tip. Softer line on that. And we got the German outline number one. Rusto fat. Rusto fat does not spray, it locks up on the can. Got a NY Skinny. Once again, locks up on the can. Uh, I think this is the Euro Fat with a gray d dot. Uh, we got a black on black cap. Forty two karat gold dot. Silver fat. And lastly, the straw tip. Okay, so you get about, uh, probably about two feet away with the straw tip and, uh, it gives pretty thin lines, but they're drippy as well, so uh, keep that in mind. And uh, as a final review, I would have to say the beige dot gave the most consistent thin line out of all of them, next to probably the iron lac stock tip, I think that's which that one was. And uh, those two definitely produced the best, but uh, beige dot probably won, as the line was really crisp and thin, whereas some of them... It's a little hard to tell on the camera, but it's kind of fuzzy on the line, and it's not so solid. And when uh, you're looking for a low pressure, you're probably looking for pretty acute, exact lines. So uh, definitely the beige dot for the low pressure can. And then as far as a fat cap goes, um, they were all pretty close. Um, not one in particular. I think I liked the size of the silver dot the most, but it does kind of have the ghost hollow. So uh, that's just something to keep in mind. So maybe you like the pink dot or the euro fat better. But uh, that's my opinion. So if you want to check out the high pressure review and cap test, uh, be sure to follow the link in the description. And uh, that's going to do it for me. Peace.